Hi, welcome to the Google AdSense channel. I'm Andreas, and today I will be taking you through the best practices to help you get your site approved. I will be giving you three recommendations to increase the chances of getting your site's approval status to ready. Before diving into the best practices, let me introduce them to you. The first best practice is to make sure your site has the correct ad code. Next, we have a second practice on having the site available. Last but not least, we will talk about our program policies to ensure the site is policy compliant. So let's get started. The first best practice is to make sure your code is complete and correct. After you've generated the ad code, you will need to place the ad code into the HTML of your site. You need to place the ad code in the head tag or at the top of the body of your page without making any changes. Please make sure you've placed the code into the same site you've added in your AdSense account. Alternatively, you can verify your site ownership in Search Console instead. If we detect that you've verified your site in Search Console, we'll continue checking if your site is ready to show ads. The second best practice is to make sure your site is reachable. We often review websites which may be down or not loading correctly. Therefore, we are unable to review these sites. Make sure that the URL you use to sign up for the AdSense account is correct and up and running globally. Your site would be unavailable if you need a password to access the site. If your site's login is password protected, consider temporarily removing the login screen so that we can reach your site. Also, make sure you are not blocking our crawler in your robots.txt file to avoid any crawler issues. You can see more details on why your site might be unreachable by clicking on the Help Center link that's in the description of this video. The final best practice is to make sure your site is policy compliant. Please review our program policies and content policies in particular. We've observed three main violations by our publishers that we'll highlight next to help you avoid them. The first violation is low value content. Make sure the content is original and valuable to your users. The second violation is having replicated content. Ensure that your content is unique and it's not repetitive on different pages of your site. When the same content is found replicated on your pages or on other sites, your site won't be approved. The third and the last main violation is site navigation. Users need to be able to easily navigate your site. This can be achieved by categorizing your content, using menu bars, and so on. Keep in mind that we may review all pages of your site and not just the sign up URL, where you place the ad code. That's why it's very important to make sure each page has valuable content that is not repetitive and is easy to navigate. In addition to these, we advise placing ad code on the most popular page of your site, which will trigger our system into recognizing your ad code and speed up the activation process. Last but not least, keep your site in the sites list as removing it might delay the review process. To summarize, here are the most important points to get your account activated. One, copy the code exactly as it appears in your AdSense homepage. Two, make sure your site is reachable. And three, review our program policies. We hope this video helps you better understand how you can get your site approved. To learn more, you can visit the AdSense Help Center and AdSense website via the links in the description of this video. Last but not least, make sure to subscribe to the Google AdSense channel for more best practices and how you can grow your site further. Thank you for watching and let us know in the comment section if you have any suggestions for new videos.